Hey, what is up, YouTube? This is Bobo23 here, bringing you back another Wi Fi battle. And today's game is supposed to be a UU game against Huge Gordon. I don't know how to pronounce that, but he's new to this uh, competitive battling stuff. So he brought 3 OUs, 2 UU, and 1 RU, I believe. Yes, but uh, I don't really care, and I'm just gonna upload this battle because I'm such a good guy. <laughs> Even though it's not that good of battle, as you can see, it's super short. So let's just jump straight to the battle. I'm just gonna lead off with my main shall go for the fake out and the high jump kick on the first turn because as I say he doesn't know much about this competitive battling and he's just gonna leave in you know staying with his like if I am maybe thinking that he's faster or whatever. I don't know, my Skype is I don't know whether you can hear or not, but yeah. So he's just gonna bring in his Glyscore, I'm gonna go for the U-turn to deal some damage, he's just gonna go for the Substitute, I don't really see Substitute on Gl Glyscore that much, so I'm just gonna bring in my Choice Pex uh, Shaman, because I know he really can't hurt me, even if he does have the what is it, Ice Fang, it won't do that much to me, so I'm just gonna go for the uh, Hidden Power Ice on the, to break the sub, as he's just gonna Toxic me and I don't really care because I do have the Natural Cure, and I don't know whether he know that or not. <laughs> so I'm just gonna uh, no wait. The better play for him on this turn is to go for the protect. Then to you know to get some poison heal damage and rack up my toxic uh damage, but to get toxic I don't know why I just say that, but never mind, I'm just gonna finish him off with hidden power eyes. As he is just gonna bring in his Victini and he could go for the victory or the U-turn and I'm just gonna bring it my slow bro and he makes a good play of going for the U-turn but I know I can take that quite well and if he wants to go for the v grid, I can take that as well so he's just gonna bring in the biggest track track the biggest threat on his team which is his Hexerus and if this thing is choice scarf I'm screwed so I'm, I know I can take an outreach so I'm just gonna go for the Thunder Wave to slow him down and possibly just kill him off with an Ice Beam from my Azelf or a Hidden Power Ice from my Shaman. So I'm just gonna go for the Side Shock to deal damage to him uh, to a point where an Ice Beam from, an, from my Azelf will definitely finish him off. So he's just gonna kill me off with this next outrage and I'm gonna bring in my Azelf and I was like, wait, what the fuck? This is the wrong Azelf. I don't, I don't have Ice Beam on this Azelf. So I need to, you know, sack something to an outrage, but he do, but he does get the, what is it? He does get Parahex right there, so I'm just gonna go for the U-turn because I know I cannot finish him off with anything and I'm just gonna speed up this part because this few part is just my, what is this, Togekiss uh, trolling his team with, uh, what is that, uh, the f S slash the pair flinching stuff, which is really annoying, trust me, I, I get trolled from Togekiss a lot of time. As you can see, there, I've just got a crit there to, uh, you know, make this game shorter. So he's just gonna go for the bolt strike, and I take that. I don't know whether that, I think it's choice scarf. If it's choice bandit, that will definitely finish me off. I take a bolt strike from Victini. That is really great. So right here, I'm just gonna <laughs> uh, flinch his Victini to death, even though his name is Hugh Equal Dead. But no, man. You equal it. So I'm just gonna go back to normal speed because I think Togekiss finish off three of his Pokemon, which is really impressive. You know that's really cool. So he's just gonna bring in his last Pokemon, which is his Tyranitar, and I'm just gonna set my Azelf to Stone Age or Crunch. But I do miss, and I'm just gonna go for Grass Knot. But he didn't go for the crunch, I do not know why, I think he doesn't have the crunch. Uh, but he's just gonna go for the ice beam and that's not gonna do anything, if he just go for the crunch, finish me off. I can just finish him off with a high jump kick from my... What is that? What is that thing called? Me and Shell. So yeah, I'm just gonna finish him off with another grass knot and that will be the game. I know he's quite sure he's not that fun of a game but yeah if you like it somehow just leave a like rate comment subscribe and i will see you guys next time bye